Welcome. In this video, we demonstrate how Cranium, our physical property estimation software, can be used to help fill in the missing values in commercial physical property databases. Chemical and physical property databases are essential tools for today's chemists and chemical engineers. These databases often contain extensive compilations of physical property data for thousands and even millions of chemicals and mixtures. However, no matter how exhaustive the compilation effort is, these databases always have missing values, simply because not all the physical properties of all the chemicals and all mixtures contained within these databases have been measured, especially the physical properties of new, novel chemicals and mixtures. Cranium, Molecular Knowledge Systems Physical Property Estimation Software, can be used to fill in these missing values with high quality estimates. To demonstrate how Cranium works, we prepared a web page that requests chemical structure information from third party databases and then sends this structural information to a web server edition of Cranium running in the cloud. Cranium generates physical property estimates that are then sent back to this web page for display. The two databases we use for our demonstration are the Royal Society of Chemistry's ChemSpider database and the National Library of Medicine's PubChem database. All that is needed to begin the estimation process is the chemical identifiers used by each database. For example, here we have the Royal Society of Chemistry's ChemSpider website. We'll search for a particular compound, a fragrance chemical called jasmine. The search produces several matches. The first match is the chemical we are interested in. Clicking on that entry shows us the details about that particular chemical, including its chemical identifier. We can copy this identifier and then switch to MKS's example web page. On this web page, we enter the RFC record ID. And for the ChemSpider database, we also need to enter an API key, which we can obtain by registering on the RFC's website. Once we've entered these values, we simply press the Estimate button. Cranium generates estimates for constant properties, and temperature-dependent properties. The reference for each of the physical property estimation techniques used by Cranium are also retrieved and displayed here. We can detail how the overall estimation process works by using this simple diagram. The web page uses the chemicals identifier to retrieve molecular structure information from the database. This structural information is then sent to the web server edition of Cranium. Cranium processes the molecular structure, retrieves physical property estimation techniques from its knowledge base, and uses these techniques to generate estimates, first for constant valued physical properties. These estimates are then sent back to the web page for display. Cranium then repeats the process for temperature-dependent physical properties. The estimated values for the melting point, the boiling point, and the critical temperature are used as limiting values to generate a series of temperature values. The web page sends the molecular structure and these series of temperatures to Cranium. Cranium then retrieves estimation techniques from its knowledge base, generates physical property estimates, and then sends these estimates back to the web page for display. Cranium displays both the temperatures at which these values were estimated and the final estimated values. We hope this video showed you how Cranium uses some initial values from your database 
values such as molecular structure, boiling points, melting points, to generate additional physical property values, values that can be used to fill in the missing values in your database. Please click on the link shown here to experiment for yourself with our example web page. And if you would like to discuss how craning can help augment your physical properties database, please send us an email. Thank you very much.